this has been a long time in the coming. I, I smell Israel all behind this. I smell unbelieving Israel behind this, deploying a religiosity onto the rest of the world through this slow process of indoctrination. He's even wearing the same outfit <laughs> from when his wife and him took their kids and got them baptized and all that. And she got baptized. Well, he's wearing the same outfit right here. And this is North as a young child, as I understand it. So they're in this cathedral in Jerusalem back in spring 2015. Perpetuated this whole anti-biblical thing where you know these particular people are above everybody else on the lower tier the bible says you're all on the one same level playing field and meeting christ we talk about you know it's a baptism that'll take place with all these reporters you know you and i get saved and, and baptized um and it's no big deal but when these multi-millionaire influencer puppet robots trained monkeys go do it they're doing it at the bidding of somebody above them that has plans that want to direct not only their lives but have it televised taped pictured and put out on all news media outlets to bring america to bring the world back to a place of religiosity and if you know that Israel is behind it and they're having dealings with Israel, then you know it's a very short little step to start bringing a level of morality with the natural laws, the Noahide laws, the one world religion, right? So you've got this slow ebb into the the Pope's One World Religion. Mike from On Point Preparedness did a really good video. I enjoyed it. It was about 16 minutes. I'll put a link down below for you. And he showed how there was just this cohesion between, you know, Kanye West wearing the Catholic Church's uh, Mary as they kind of bastardized Revelation 12 at one of his Sunday services. And uh, this is all show. This is all to get people prepared for the implementation of that Antichrist who's coming. And I bet you anything in the coming whatevers, as we draw closer and closer to his coming, they're, they're going to start promoting Noahide from the celebrities because this is now going to be used to bring you into it and to criticize Christianity. See how this is all starting to piece together? So he's got this Sunday service and I don't know if I'll be able to find a picture here, but maybe you know, he's got the Catholics, he's got the Pentecostal um, not Pentecostals, the, uh, the many preachers, T.D. Jakes, the Benningham, he's got the Roman Catholic church he's highly critical of the church he's he's got um i don't know if i'll be able to find this or not my computer might just be like oh no you didn't put all the stuff in there um oh how kanye west and church merch are making are bring are bringing back $50 socks? Are you serious? Wow. This made it to Vanity Fair. See, you can't convince me that this is legit when you have the whole world filming it. <laughs> Granted, I grew up with a different set of clothing 
uh, criteria for church clothes. Is this truly what you want to be caught wearing on Judgment Day, it says? <laughs> That's funny. You know, you have him on one hand blaspheming Christ. Now you have him on another hand elevating Jesus Christ. Like, which way, Kanye? What are you doing? Actually, he's still blaspheming Jesus Christ. He's just accepting the role of the lead. Friends with Trump. Trump is part and parcel of the NAR, the New Apostolic Reformation. Reformation, rather. They are the ones that are saying we're going to we're going to perfect the earth and make it conditions palatable palatable for uh, Christ to come back. That's not how scripture says it's going to happen. And you have this coming dissemination of the, the antichrist. That's exactly what's going on. Uh, there's an article here. Okay, here we go. Why evangelical megachurches are embracing some Catholic what? Well, they've been talked to. Didn't the Pope go around and say, you need to do this now? This is not happening organically, people. Look, see all these different church flags. Look at that. See, we're going to become one mind, just like the book. Are embracing some Catholic traditions. Well, yeah, I mean, you've had the emergent church doing this forever. I grew up in Colorado Springs, a Catholic girl in the evangelical New Jerusalem. In addition to focus on the family, Colorado Springs is home to more than 100 evangelical ministries. Blah, blah, blah. Don't care. What is this? America, the Jesuit Re Review. Okay. I'm kind of just skimming this. Celebrity preachers. Did you ever think that those two words <laughs> would be used in a sentence together? Like, can you just imagine Paul being like, celebrity preachers? That's so whack. I can't even. Uh, I can't even deal with this. This is so bizarre. See, Christianity is being changed from within. They've just had people that are unsaved go in as, as a churchianity people to infect and indoctrinate, to devour from within. Didn't Christ's words say this very thing would happen? Oh, my goodness. Okay, it's all about outside exterior appearance of religiosity. I'm kind of just skimming this article. There is a Jesus being worshipped here, all right, but it's not the Jesus of the Bible. It's not the spirit of the Bible. Mega churches are typically known for their concert-like experiences, lasers, smoke machines, espresso bars. Worship bands full of young, <laughs> cool people. <laughs> this is painful. And a pastor in jeans and t-shirt preaching on short passages of the scripture in a way that is positive, uplifting, and immediately relevant <laughs> to everyday change. <laughs> There's so much there that is appealing to worshipers, so why make a change now? Oh my, that's appealing. I mean, I'm off of the coffee thing, but that's about it. Boy, oh, how times have changed. Whoa, they believe the ancient ritual gestures, sacraments, and rope prayers like the rosary get in the way at best that worse they are idols to be despised. Okay, right. Weird. We need to give the gospel for people to be born again. It's kind of a long article. Wow. 
<sighs> we had communion twice a year and it wasn't seen as important? Oh, this is so wrong. Reciting creeds. Creeds have their place, but they don't replace anything. That's weird. Oh, right. Okay, so Willow Creek, Mars Hill. Right. Well, these guys are heretics. <laughs> 24,000 members. Does that just not seem really weird to anybody else? Seems weird to me. It's like they've laid a foundation of creating a vacuum so that people would be so starving, hungry, you know, problem, reaction, their solution. <sighs> that they can just fill in that deep internal inner need. NT, right? Oh, no. Homeboy's got problems. Henry Nowen and Eugene Peterson. Well, I mean, those are heretics. <laughs> There's something missing. Something was the Eucharist. It was sacramentally. What does that have to do with anything? Are people just so seriously unaware of scripture? This is really weird. Well, you know, we just connected with things the Catholic Church does. Right. I mean, they were the ones that killed a whole bunch of people for control freak reasons. You think much has changed between now and then? Bible centered my foot. Candlelight service. Oh, brother. All about Christ. I doubt it. Oh, are you serious? <laughs> Ye is written. You know, this is so <laughs> blasphemous. This article, Ye is risen. Welcome to the Church of Kanye West. Well, yeah, it's a church that everybody loves, right? Except those mean Christians. They don't love anything. <laughs> Um, that's a setup for the Antichrist. I mean, just straight up. <laughs> that's, that's where it's going. That's why Kanye was talking about Kim's wardrobe for, uh, the Met Gala. That's why it's being highlighted. <laughs> See, ecumenicism. Oh, wow. If, if evangelical and new generation worship have been in part about making church cool, ironic, there's nothing cooler than the first edition and the Catholic church is about as vintage as you can get. Are you serious? Are you kidding me? Wow. This is why people need to learn how to think for themselves. Yeah. You're being, oh, good grief. You're being led by your nose. To paganism. Kanye is just the step in between. <laughs> oh my. See all their little outfits and costumes? Yeah, God's not into that. Wow. So this paper is like a pro Catholic paper. So she's like, cool. Bring it all in. This is um, so satanic. Why is he wearing purple? Purple is such a royal color you know the christians think that if they ignore this it's going to go away but i submit to you that this is exactly what's going to usher in whoa the devil and they're making a boatload of money oh my this is uh this is demonic 
Oh, what it, what was that scripture? It says they'll make merchandise of you. Yeah. Right there. Somebody's going to get it. And through covetousness, shall they with feigned words make merchandise of you, whose judgment now of long lingereth not, and their damnation slumbereth not. Damnation. You used Christ to make money. That will not go well for you.